it seems the wind calls me back to Ramne. Best tell her the good news. Eivor. What happened yesterday? You and Sigurd disappeared during the feast. And when he returned, he went straight to our room without a word. We talked for a time. I asked many questions, but got few answers. I wish I could say more. Sigurd wants to blame me for every mishap that has befallen him, but gives me no credit for his rescue. I don't understand. Yet he does speak with you. With me, he has gone totally silent. So... What now? This is for Sussex. We burned it to the ground to save one man. Yet he's barely the man we were searching for. Quite so. I want to see the Alliance map. What can you tell me of Vinland? Is it a real place, or merely a rumor? Rumor or not, I found someone willing to sail you there. She claims to have seen it once before. If she's willing to risk her life beside me, and make the long journey, I'll take her at her word. Nessa is her name. Meet her at the docks when you are ready to leave. I'll go now, and end the life of Gorm Kjotveson, where the Valkyries cannot find him. It is a long voyage, Eivor. Be careful. <clears throat> Quite delicious. Good day to you, stranger. Nessa, is it? I am Eivor. Ranvi said you would be my guide. That is right. Passage to across the seas to St. Brenton's land, is that right? Ranvi called it Vinland. One and the same. It is a three-week trip by longship. Arduous, dull, possibly fatal. Should we survive, you'll be compensated. Eivor, before you go, you must be dressed as a thrall when you arrive. To be seen as you are would raise suspicions. Gorm runs this new camp, and it is a good bet all but a few will be loyal to him. Good thinking. Only taking care of our prized Drenger. First things first, Eivor. My ship, my rules. Second, you follow the rules. Third, if you listen to my rules, you live. Understood. Good. Let me know when you're ready and we'll get going. Mm. Quite delicious. I'll leave my gear behind and dress the part. To Vinland we go. Hop in! We'll leave now! Three cold weeks on the whale road. Past mountains of ice and kingdoms of stone. Saga lands.
all this way to kill a man, Gorm Kjotveson, the son of my father's old foe. What dark work does the Order have so far across the open sea? Someone in charge. I'd better step with Kier. No friends here. You! You look stronger than most of the others. What's your name? Jora of Jorvik. Jora? As in horse? My father never wanted children. What is this place? Newhaven. A wild place found on no map. Are we settling here? That is not our plan. Too many wild folk in the woods. They threaten us. You ask too many questions, horse. Your task is to keep your mouth shut and do as I tell you. Now, unload that ship and then I'll have you carry those Hildi! carrots. Hildi! Hildi! We can't find Olaf. Look his ass, not again. We cannot send supplies to Gorn without his guidance. Ugh! Pull what supplies we have to the nearest camps, then. Gorm's men will do the rest. Let me go. I can carry whatever supplies Gorm needs. That's Olaf's job, horse. Not yours. You stick to this port and keep your head down. Ask around about Olaf. Someone must know where he has run off to. If I can find this Olaf, he may know where Gorm is. Grab a shovel from Gorm's storehouse? No, it is a rotten place, that store. Smashed crates. Somebody crawled off, left a trail of blood. Have a look, Sunan.
broke through here. Made quite a mess. Could be Olaf went this way. Someone picked the lock and got away. War was hauled off. Could be a trail. Go, Sunan. This trail leads to high ground. Good. I can get my bearings. such a place. Quiet. And not a stone building in sight. Those two carry themselves like leaders. It's worth a try. friends do you do we do we understand one another oya kanya tera keronu jokna hoda tiga de giga yungwe do any of you speak norse or saxon zazade gwat giga yungwe ya te de wa yanderi ya de yungwe ye hri ze ona zini to dit ni gohra di hantos ne gaa Giga odzi da'a, wa o nazi ne giga yungwe. Tigade na ne e. This is Sunan. Her name means insight. Yanja dahawe giga, zi nue oya ganyatara keronu i tres. Danu ahinasku. Ahoya dagenha doga ahuna darohage giga. Sunan, you made us some friends. These huts. Close. Am I in Midgard? They're still. Waterfalls are places of power in the old sagas. Giga oya ganyatera keheronu rodaska. Nine days I hung in the tree. Nine days. You hear me? There is a language I know well. But the words are mind sick. Zatunde gatiga, roja datkum, zat sensant doga asqueni, toner era ancha da hawite negaa. Then I threw my eye in the well. This is wisdom. Sounds like the ranting of a seer. Who are you? Olaf, I am. Olaf. Called the unlucky, but don't you believe it? And where is, uh... I promised you would do it quick. 
What? Do not stab me from behind, Trengur. Like Sigurd and the dragon. Please. I'm not here to kill you. I've come for Gorm. N not not here to kill me? Not today. Oh, stay clear of Gorm, then. He's not a good man, not a good man at all. Why would you need to see such a terrible man? It is a matter of honor, and Gorm owes me a great debt. Let's leave it at that. Oh, good. Yes. Yes, honor is good. Olaf will help you. Olaf will help you so much. Honor is the only thing. Yes, the only thing. I saw signs of a struggle at your camp. Did something happen between you and Gorm? Nothing to speak of. He, um, did not care for me trading with the villagers here. Beat me and put me in chains. I slipped away free. Not so unlucky, am I? Still alive, yes. Still alive. Good. Point me toward Gorm. Not possible. He is away. Far away at the camps in these woods. All well guarded. Might be at anyone. Why camps? Is he settling here? Or searching for something? Searching, yes. Always searching. And never finding the mean, mean backrot. And how do I find these camps? I can show you. Follow, follow, follow. Olaf, would you tell me something? Anything Olaf can tell, Olaf will tell my new and big friend. Why would Gorm cross the sea to this nameless wilderness? It seems a great risk for so little. Gorm carries with him a crystal that talks. It tells him where to go and what to do. A talking crystal? It is truth. The elf stone tells him to seek, and so he seeks. And when it says dig, he digs. Such a mystery. What is he digging for? <laughs> that is a mystery he will not tell. <laughs> but my guess is the best guess. He seeks the door to Jotunheim. <laughs> across the river. One of Gorm's camps. All look like that. All of them. They are well guarded, you say? Oh, yes. By fierce men. Warriors who attack any stranger on sight. Anyone. And they are all well armed. Not like you. As well equipped as a stable hand. <laughs> it does not take much to kill a man. But sharp steel helps. Oh, yes. You are not wrong. I could use better weapons. Olaver will help. Gather ore and hides to barter for war gear. Ore and hides? I can find out there? Yes. Yes! Some in the woods, much more at Gorm's camps. Than traded all with the people here. Easy as a smile. Yes. Yes. I don't understand the language. Can you translate for me? No need, no. We talk with signs. Just walk up to a trader and start trading. Take this. Some goods to get you started. Thank you for this, Olaf. And until I say otherwise, speak nothing of this to anyone. Might be a good idea to trade, now that I'm here. He seems eager to trade goods and wares. God, the Jodadu. Otena God does a Duhunzoni. E. E. Walks with Ego. I'm off. Be well, friend.
I can hike into the woods straight for Gorm. Or gather raw materials and trade for better weapons. Quite a number you've taken. <laughs> it was not me alone. My friends and I won them. We call ourselves the Toothbreakers. Sadly, we were separated by a beast of a kind we have never seen. In one fell swoop, it tore our group apart. We are supposed to meet here to hunt that creature before returning home. And so, I wait. Wait in safety, then. Safe travels. And watch the woods. Gorm is in these woods somewhere. Cutting the ocean skin, and when the dawn arrives, the time for hunt begins. They are making me wait quite a while. Nessa, is your ship headed for England? It is. Are you ready to head back? No, I must yet perform a few tasks. Do not take long, as we must return before the winter storms stir the cold sea. Over the waves we sail, cutting the ocean skin. And when the dawn arrives... What do you see? I will find you, Gur, no matter how long it takes. all over. I thought I was dead. Do de Gordier. Doga on Saya ge gigon. On de wat zerun on de zerun hyagon. Saya. You want me to... to eat these? Our friends healed me with their berries. I'm grateful. Yes, yes. And elderberries have a good taste, too. And good for you. I feel much better. Do these elderberries grow wild around here? Yes, yes. All through the land. Here and there. Olaf, 
Tell me about your falling out with Gurm. He caught me stealing from his locked chests. I wished to trade with the villagers here. Then he gave you a good thrashing, did he? Yes, yes. Now I stay in my safe place. Where are you hiding, Kor? Skana. Neon ha a joyonere. Otena gun does a dohunzoni. I'll see you later, friend. One of Gorham's camps. I might learn where he's hiding. Or find some resources at the least. Nothing here for you. Ah! The Arger Mare running away! Now you pay! Try to trip the fool! Remember Bracky's double thrust? Ah, 
wager on who gets the kill? Eyes open. One step closer.
Tad kā tev no hoda vagat gēru? Ne jau un hāla džo jānere. Jāvā. I must take my leave. So long. Brendan of Clonfert, servant of our Lord. Final inscription before this holy fount of light. My journey is ended. For two and some years have I heeded the inner voice of my Lord and followed it to this place to receive his word. I have seen the gate with its ancient markings. I have heard the voice of his angel calling me beloved. Yet, the way did not open. His voice yet calls to me still in blissful...
feel something. Light and heat. Should be cautious around here. Why is this place so heavily guarded? What are you hiding, Gorm? You pay for that! <laughs> Thank you. 
this bridge cliff camp may know Gorm's whereabouts. A camp near the village. Gorm could be there. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> 
going on now.
The Jodadu. I I walk so tigo. Yo yonder did no hold the wasser dogo. O ten ago does a do hunzoni? I must be on my way now. Goodbye.
I'm over here. A camp overrun with bears. Praise Odin that you found me. But be still. In the hands of the ferocious tree shakers. My wounds hurt deep. If you could carry me to safety, kinsman, I would be indebted. Slowly, slowly now. You are safe now. Thank you. Thank you, kinsman. I was so helpless against them. I even tried to use a key I found as a weapon. But the brute swallowed it. Now I will never know what that key unlocks. How did you come to be stuck here? My friends, the Toothbreakers, were with me. But we were separated when I went searching for what my key might open. I ended up snooping around that abandoned camp. And that's when they showed up. Bears! So many bears! Oh, I must catch my breath.
Go on.
They will attack on sight here. In time, what once was, shall be, again. Stay sharp. such cowardice.
I cross the broad sea for your good. Are you not flattered? One reason only, I see. You snake. <laughs> One reason only. Wait, this is not the Hall of 500 Doors. This is not the Rock of the Fallen. Where are the women on the winged horses? Where are the choosers of the slain? My blood enemy! This is Niflheim, the hell of mist and cold. This is where the faithless dead come to die again. This is where ghosts fade to mist to be forgotten. Your meddling has doomed us all, Crow of Battle. More lies from a liar born. Now speak the truth. What brought the Order to this place? To free a goddess. A creature of power and light. Buried by the Jotna in ages past. A pity, Gorm. You will not meet her now. Crystal eye. It hums with a strange feeling. Unearthly. What was Gorm digging for? Something deep inside this cave. Olaf should know his tormentor is dead. I owe him that much.
The probabilities lead us here. The calculations give us hope. This... this is not for me. I should return to all love. He deserves to know what happened here. Must be careful now. They must be hiding. Those are too big. Hey, what? Die! Your time's up! Make the throne cut! You sheep! Cast about this land, my friend.
Wait a second. Time has come for you. <laughs> <laughs>
You can do it, pet! Come on! Drop something? Good old Arnim, my beloved pet, fell down. Well, flew his way down below. Now the poor thing is stuck. I cannot seem to encourage my Arnim to fly back up. <sighs> Looks like we still have a long way to go. You can do it, pet! Come on! <laughs> Come on! We didn't train all that time for no... It cannot fly. I'll have to lead it back up. Watch out for his affections. Nana is the fiery salt, loves to give kisses. Please don't kill him if he takes you a bit. By Odin, this bird is as foul as they come. You can fly to Helheim. Oh, look, he's ours. I suppose it was his fate. He was one of the slower ones. I guess I will go back to my friends, the Toothbreakers. I hope they still wait for me at the port. No nodding off now. Zat kahto no hoda wagat geru. Ne on ha a joyanere.
i i Waxo Tigo. Tena go does a duhun zoni? Yawa. Neon ha a joy under there. I must take my leave. So long. This giant spawn must die. Mm-hmm. <sighs> 
Together, all right? <laughs> now you pay! Anything <laughs> Only end. Luck skipped his turn. Take you back to Newhofen. A tall ask for a corpse.
You have some weight on you. there. pig piss. It is clear. Good stranger. <laughs> Brother, you should have listened to me. You have always been too selfish, reckless. Even mother said so. Blame not the adventurer, for the pull of blood songs can tempt even the gods. Where do I go now? Without you to guide me, what should I do? Lost. I am lost. His path is in front of you, child. He would want you to follow it, to do what he can no longer do. His bow... I could teach myself how to use it. I could, couldn't I? Remember your brother, and all that he is. Bring home his tales and let his legacy be grown. That is all we are. Words and song. I will hone my bowcraft. And he will smile upon me from above. He will be proud. To charge you Thank you for bringing him back. Thank you. Well I'm going to be the best hunter no, ever. We should be more Just careful like this you, time. Brother. We track it, then Wait we corner it. I will shoot that elk in the eye. Good stranger. Thank you for your help. I heard what happened. We are just about to set off on our grand hunt for the fearsome beast. If the thirst of the hunt itches your throat, will you join us? Frey! What? What? No! No! Is that...? He is in the horse now. I... I am sorry, Frey. Into the unknown we go. Join us, kinsmen. This beast bested us last time. We should be on our guard. Rex. Hey! There is no mistaking it. It came from the same creature that attacked us. Ah, hey! Please, can we get along? Your horseplay will be our death. So, uh, what brings you here, kinsman? Was it the pull of the wilderness? The thrill of the hunt? You could say that. Then you will not be disappointed. However, be warned. This beast is quick to bite and fearless.
Come on, then. There it is. Gods, it's even more ferocious than before. That glorious pelt. Oh, what a prize it is. Good fighting. Ah, oh, what a beast we felt. You show true grit out there. Thank you for joining our hunt. Predator or prey, you are what you choose to do. Arne! Oh well, he lasted the longest amongst the rest. Now we can finally return home with our head high! Your time's up! <clears throat> No need to hide now, Olaf. Gorm is dead. Gorm? Dead? Uh, by your hand? He paid a bloody price for broken honor. I will not say more. Return to your sister. Oh, I will. Yet I would first join the villagers at their fire. They tell stories and I like to listen. Though I do not hear. Story time? Telling sagas of their own? Yes, yes! They tell stories. Yes, come, listen. Zokki, rarondunde wasago horori ne yotzi zizu, waharu hau toyedene zinuwe rodiskara gete junk kuero takwani dehni zaruki totni takwe ya dehni ganare ziosunwaya. Danu akwegu, gasunwa hunzi. Yotzi zizu, yagoda denekwa the wagu, danu rarondo de, yesunne yirade. Zokki, o sumagu, ya untke doda, ahyarek, dogatka negre. 
tunda ya wasi, rarondo de ya sagorda ge. O sumagu ya ea da ne ne yotzi zizu. Zi wa agoyant da haje, wa ea na hadu, zi na hoda wa egweni. Nia de gahderda ge, ya ehoe, zi ya ea da ne, zi de jutsu wagardas. God's got Naraga. Tagwa gotta do us. I do not understand. Ah, oh, oh, you want me to tell a story? All right. Let me think. A story of betrayal, of selfish malice, and of gods who act as spoiled children. Of all our many gods, it is Odin who is the most revered. He is the All-Father, the High One, the Wise King. But for all his glories, he can also be the most elusive of his kind. Selfish, solitary, stubborn, even cruel. In days long gone, it came to pass that Odin's son Balder died suddenly, felled by his only weakness, mistletoe. Believing his son's death an accident, Odin sent a message to the Jotun, Hel, asking her to return his beautiful boy to life. Hel agreed, but on one condition. Only if every living creature in the Nine Worlds shed a loving tear for Balder. At once, Odin sent word to every corner of the world, asking all to weep for his beloved boy. And all did, but one. A Jotun named Thok refused to cry for Balder. Let Hel keep what she has received, Thok said with malice. And that was that. Balder was gone forever. Send on a funeral ship across the sea, buried in Midgadir, amid trees and rocks. What Odin did not know is that Thok was none other than the trickster Loki in disguise, a god he knew as a friend. Worse still, it was Loki who led Baldur to his death by a sprig of mistletoe. All these tricks and feints Loki had conceived. Some say it was in Loki's nature to be so cruel. Others argue it was revenge for deeds done by Odin to Loki and his children. There is a third view, that all these acts, kind and cruel, were sown long ago in the pattern of their lives. That we are not the authors of our own destiny, but only its readers, and that we... Oh. <laughs> that we should fight against this view, for it is deeply unwelcome. Angwa gara duha se ne at nowara rao gara. Ne ne oh niot ti wat hadet nowia ge. Gorum brought this stone across the whale road for a strange purpose. I do not know why, but it seems to belong to this land. Yos, gods. Take it, and guard it. It may be that one day you will know its purpose. Thank you. Each of you. For all you have done.
Ej nu. Ej gik godt. No word from Gorm. He And he has taken all the hunter. Yorav Jorvik. You shirked your work for quite some time. Yorra is no more. My name is Eivor, a Drengir of the Raven Clan, and my purpose is fulfilled. Purpose? <laughs> what purpose? Gorm is dead! The troll is dead! Olaf! Sister, let us celebrate. Gorm Kötveson is no more. Slain by Eivor Ravenfriend. Eivor Forest Rider. Eivor Olavusaver. What is this? I had a long-standing blood feud with Gorm and his clan. It is now laid to rest. Oh, the skulls will sing of this day. How Eivor traveled far and wide, hunting Gorm along the world's rim. Songs or not, Gorm is dead. Now I suggest you leave this place. There is no purpose for us here. I... I do not disagree. Gordon was a madman and a troll indeed. But he paid us in silver and that was enough. Brother, are you well? I feared the worst for you. I am well, yes, oh, so well. And I may stay, to linger one season or two, with the friends I have made. As you wish, brother. And you, Eivor, where will you go? Across the sea with us, or back into the woods? I will sail with you. Let's go. Take care of yourself, Olaf. In this life, and the next. Goodbye. Goodbye. Far whence the whale rode before me. Dark are the deeds that brought me here. Fate may bind my bones to this land, but for now, I walk the sea. <laughs>